So I'm gonna be giving away one set of the Logitech MX Keys S combo. To be eligible for this giveaway, you have to comment down below your custom smart action, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and give me a follow on Instagram. I'll randomly select a lucky winner within a week's time and I'll DM you on Instagram so I could go ahead and ship out the Logitech MX Keys S combo. So Logitech recently announced the launch of their upgraded version of the Logitech MX Keys, the MX Keys S. For context, Logitech's MX Keys series of keyboard is really meant for power users. Those of you all who are trying to be as productive and optimize your keyboard typing experience to its fullest capability. So if you're a programmer, an engineer or designer, this keyboard series is meant to optimize your workflow. One thing I actually already really enjoy about the launch of the MX Keys S is the packaging. Logitech MX Keys S and the Logitech MX Master 3S are now packaged together, which may not be the biggest deal, but I do like the more minimal unboxing experience. You all probably already know a ton about the Logitech MX Keys. And to be honest with you, the MX Keys S isn't that much different in terms of its style, design, profile, like tactile response when it comes to your typing experience. But there are a few key differences, few, few key differences that may be worth the upgrade. So for starters, the layout is a bit different. There are three new buttons added to the Logitech MX Keys S, which is dictation, mute and unmute, and of course, emoji. It's 2023, like every keyboard should have an emoji key at this point. Since receiving my keyboard, I've been using the emoji key a ton. I mean, hey, I work in tech and most of us talk in emoji. One other amazing feature that pairs amazingly well with the Logitech MX Keys S is smart actions. So I just wanna show you how quick and easy it is to create smart actions. Logitech has some awesome templates, so we're gonna go ahead and add a few to our devices first. So we're gonna go ahead and click Smart Actions, and as you can see, there are a plethora of Smart Action templates. The first one I'm going to add is Reply with ChatGBT. I use ChatGBT all the time, so this template will be really helpful. So after triggering this action, this Smart Action copies your highlighted text, opens a ChatGBT tab in your default browser, and paste the content you have highlighted into the text box to send a message to ChatGPT. To add the smart action, simply select a trigger. And in this case, I will select the MX Master 3S top button to trigger ChatGPT. Confirm trigger. You'll select the top button on the MX Master 3S and that will activate the smart action. The next smart action I'm gonna to add to automate some of my programming workflow is the pull project changes smart action. I'm gonna go ahead and navigate to templates and then in the second row, you'll see the pull project changes smart action. Now I'm gonna make my trigger the MX keys calculator button. So I'm gonna go ahead and confirm that trigger. And when I click this calculator button, it will trigger the pull project changes smart action. What this smart action does is it opens up the terminal. There's a one second delay. Then it navigates to your home directory, does a keystroke return, AKA enter, and then it does a git pull and then another enter. Lastly, I'm gonna create a custom smart action called git focus with Spotify. The objective of this smart action is to optimize my focus time when I first start up my laptop on days without morning meetings, allowing me to dedicate it uninterrupted time to coding. So we're gonna go ahead and click create. My trigger is actually gonna be the MX keys S lock button. Confirm that trigger. Now this is where the fun part happens. We're gonna add the actions that we want for this specific smart action. We're gonna go ahead and click add action. The first thing I wanna do is I actually want to show my B focused Pomodoro timer. Click confirm. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna open up Spotify so we can set a nice vibe for this, for this like Pomodoro focus session. I'm gonna go ahead and click open app. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna add Visual Studio code to this smart action and we're gonna open up VS Code. And why not open up the terminal because I like to work in the terminal and in an IDE. So we're gonna go ahead and I actually use the I term. So we're gonna go ahead 
and open that application, confirm that. And now we're gonna go ahead, confirm this smart action and we're gonna call it get focus with Spotify. Confirm. And now you see we have our two templates, which are pull project changes, reply with chat GPT, and then our custom get focus with Spotify smart action. My initial reaction is that the Logitech MX Keys S from a stylistic, ergonomic, and design standpoint is almost exactly the same as the previous version, Logitech MX Keys. But there is a distinct difference in terms of the improved layout in the Logitech MX Keys S. So if you're someone who already owns the Logitech MX Keys and maybe yours is dusty because you've owned it for quite some time, I definitely think you'll enjoy the upgrade. The introduction of smart actions, new improved layout with the addition of the dictation, mute, unmute, and emoji keys. I honestly can't think of a better keyboard, especially for remote workers. As I mentioned, since receiving the keyboard and taking advantage of the new keyboard, layout i myself enjoy automating repetitive actions i also use my laptop in other ways outside of work like responding to text messages and engaging with my audience on social media so i feel like i have almost more of a mobile experience with the improved keyboard layout and as a remote worker working in tech, I take a lot of Zoom meetings. So it's really nice to minimize my usage of my mouse and be able to interact with my colleagues, with my keyboard more than I've ever been able to in the past. Thank you to Logitech for sponsoring today's video. Also, don't forget the giveaway rules so you have a chance of winning the MX Keys S combo. And if you're interested in purchasing the Logitech MX Keys S combo, be sure to click this link in the description box. With that said, I'll see you all soon. Peace.